here I am in fog in um, the Broadwater, very dangerous, you know, slow down, start making signals, check your EIS, um, hard to make out what's happening until suddenly couldn't miss this Soren Larsen, a big square rigger, she came out of the mist um, as I'm going along on my way to the Cumbria River, um, making my way up the Cumbria River um, to moor at the um, Hope Island Marina, which is uh, conveniently near um, the boat show where um, I was due to do work. Um, it's a liveaboard marina, Hope Island uh, Marina, so it's quite a friendly marina, a lot of people on the pontoons. Um, I was lucky to actually get booked in here, but it's a 10 minute cycle uh, uh, to the boat show, the Sanctuary Cove Boat Show 2022. So I was there to do some work, check out boats and then do some sea trials. Um, always trying to give support to the local guys like the Maritimos, the Rivieras. Um, some big cruise boats, cruising boats like this Juno 60 yacht, beautiful yacht with a huge aft cabin and a vast covered um, cockpit, easy sail plan, furling main and jib. Um, yeah, inside it's, you know, it's like an apartment, um, very modern, very open plan. So, you know, out at sea, it can be a little bit challenging maybe trying to hold on to things but look at this it's absolutely luxurious another huge yacht was a 90 foot ocean alexander explorer style yacht which is basically a long range you know mini super yacht um with incredible finish this taiwanese built um yacht um it's got a master suite on the main deck which is quite incredible so you wake up basically uh, looking out um, over the sea from a quite a height and the bridge is pretty amazing um, it's got a extended um, external party time of course always good to catch up with my colleagues and all the people in the boating industry that I work with got to kick back and have a bit of a laugh but yeah plenty more work to do and uh, yeah, another job I had to do was go through this boat, the XS11. This is one of the smallest production catamarans on the market, and it's a lively boat with outboard helms. And um, I enjoyed taking this boat out for a spin um, on a pretty windy day, so I'd um, reefed down the main and um, pretty lively with uh, Mika from I Flagstaff. Up, I like Mika and I took it for a blast out in the broad water. Um, yeah, really, really fun catamaran. But back to the big 90-footer Ocean Alexander. I had to take that one out as well, which is quite amazing. Um, steering a 90-foot a, a super yacht is pretty, pretty thrilling. Um, here I'm off the, uh, off the uh, Gold Coast, putting her through some manoeuvres. Um, um, you're at a very uh, elevated position here with the electronic wheel and the beautiful bridge deck area and that's the uh, main suite I was telling you about vast engine room and um, yeah but yeah finish the boat show back to my own boat getting on with stuff really making a to-do list for Skybird now um, as we plan more projects and one of them is uh, finally got a, a generator set, a Gentrax uh, 2000 uh, watt uh, model so that will power you know 240 AC power tools and um, do most things yeah and it's great marina this Hope, uh, Hope Island Marina really good uh, tavern to chill out at while I make to do lists for the boat and um, enjoy the uh, looking west um, towards the Great Dividing Range and um, another beautiful sunset. Um, this marina is fully booked um, and liverboards are welcome, but getting in there is pretty tricky. But it's got coals, it's got beautiful bars, it's really got everything, including look at the beautiful swifts flying by. Mm -hmm.